Hi, my name's Daniel and today I'm going to be talking to you about HEMA. Now I thought I would make this video series to track my progress as I learn more about HEMA, I improve my skills and I develop. I'm very, very new to this sport. I've just started learning under Dave Rawlings at the London Longsword Academy. I've been to a single lesson. So I'm going to start by talking about what kit I took, what I needed in order to get involved, and hopefully give you an idea of what you would need if you wanted to go along to an introductory lesson and find out what's going on. So Dave told me to just come along in normal, comfortable wear that I would go to the gym in. So I did exactly that. I was wearing what I'm wearing now, this light t-shirt, pair of tracksuit bottoms, and absolutely bog standard normal trainers. Nothing particularly exciting about them. Didn't cost a lot of money, nothing specialist at all. So I went along, took part in the lesson, did some work with daggers, with Dusak, and with Pike, and all of that was very, very interesting. Now personally, I'm interested in learning to fight with Messer and Kriegsmesser, but that doesn't mean to say that I don't want to learn to fight with the other weapons as well. I would suggest that no matter what weapon you're interested in, you go along, you find a HEMA club, and you give it a go with whatever they happen to be training at the time. As I understand it, there's quite a lot of crossover between the different weapons and techniques and things. Um, I'll learn more as I go along. So, apart from this that I'm wearing, what other kit do I have? Well, I have one more thing that I'm using for practice uh, when I'm not at the club and I can't get access to their equipment, and that is this, my Bokken. Um, I've been doing Japanese martial arts since I was about six years old. I haven't done any though for maybe five years, so I'm really quite unfit. Um, I'm out of practice, I don't know what I'm doing. And also the stuff that I learned for fighting with this and with my katana um, is not appropriate for HEMA really. Uh, I'm not saying nothing is similar, obviously there are, it's still a sword, but I'm deliberately not using anything that I know about this sort of thing to practice HEMA because I want to learn that martial art. And maybe in a few years time when I'm competent at it, then I can start combining things. Um, so that's it for now. I will talk to you again in another video soon and let you know how things are progressing. See ya.